right, time for a look at uh, arts and lifestyle. Adam, <laughs> you said that. <laughs> well, I'm excited. <laughs> well, uh, and you know who is excited, and that is a, a Saanich High School student who has been picked to perform for an audience of more than 45,000 people. Ijun Kwan is this year's Victoria Symphony Splash Young Soloist, and she says that her performance skills have been honed in part by doing a little bit of karaoke. I really like music, so I especially like the singing, like listening and dancing to K-pop. <laughs> to K-pop? Yes. Korean pop music? I'm from Korea. <laughs> Why do you love K-pop? It's so much fun. <laughs> I just go to karaoke with my friends and just sing. <laughs> are, are you better as a violinist or better as a karaoke singer? <laughs> violinist, unfortunately. <laughs> Well, Kwan only does karaoke with her friends a couple times a month. She rehearses her violin a couple hours a day. The 17-year-old Mount Doug student has been playing classical music since she was six. At Splash, she will join the orchestra on the Inner Harbor Barge to play the first movement of Mendelssohn's Violin Concerto. It's a very musical piece and also technically kind of challenged. <laughs> and I really like the lyrical passages and I especially like the singing melodies all throughout the piece. My goal is to really connect with the audience. Um, usually with performances I'm never satisfied with, <laughs> but I think for this one I'm gonna practice extra hard so I can actually like convey my musical ideas. The rest of the Splash lineup was also revealed at this morning's Symphony Partner Appreciation Breakfast. You can expect to hear a tribute to movie soundtrack composer John Williams. There will also be two pieces celebrating Victoria's 150th anniversary. One about Chinatown, the other inspired by the sounds of the Inner Harbor, written by local composer Tobin Stokes. And of course, Tchaikovsky's 1812 Overture featuring the usual cannons and fireworks. And it's about experiencing great personal connection to other people. The mission of the Victoria Symphony is to enrich lives through the shared experience of extraordinary music. And it is that shared experience that can never be duplicated by a, a sound system. You may have a wonderful sound system at home. It's great if you listen to music, but doing it with other people, that's what's really, really special. Symphony Splash is August 5th. That's a Sunday. The festivities will begin at 1 p.m. with events for the whole family. And you can find full details on Splash and the orchestra's other summer concerts by visiting its website. Well, our sister station, Cool FM, is expanding its Fan Fest because it was so popular last time. They now have a new, bigger venue and a world-renowned headliner. Kanon is best known for his 2010 World Cup anthem, Wave and Flag. He will be headlining a concert stage at the Bear Mountain Arena. He'll be joined by Juno and Much Music Video Award winner Sean Desmond and a lineup of soon to be announced local musicians. With the recent success of someone like Carly Rae Jepsen, it's local radio that was playing her in the first place when, say, someone like Justin Bieber heard her song and she's become a huge success in the States. So it's important to get our emerging artists some exposure, airtime, and to see them live. Why the heck not? The Cool FM Fan Fest is August 18th the Bear Mountain Arena. Tickets go on sale this Saturday at 10 a.m. Details are available from 1073cool.fm.